Chance for Webb to fire the cross in. <laughs> and it almost uh, causing problems there for Milojevic. I think they're under instructions there, Mark, to test this keeper very early, and it couldn't be much earlier than that. The high ball floated in, and the keeper taking no chances at all. United corner. Tied in by Martin, but on the far side. Appeals for handball. And the referee points to the spot. Well, Trevor, did you think that was a penalty? We won't see more, many more blatant penalties than that, Mark. The header back across the area, I think, was from Gary Pallister. And uh, the defender, well, clearly stuck his arm up. You see it here. And uh, that had to be a spot kick. So a great early chance for United then to open their account, Mark. And uh, what a gift, really, isn't it? Well, it is, and it'll open up the game. Let's see if uh, Steve Bruce is the man who's going to take it. Knocks them in for fun ordinarily for Manchester United. And Milojevic tested for the second time in just the second minute. There can't be a better penalty taker in the country than Steve Bruce at the moment. And he's, well, Milojevic read it well. Webb fires it in. The chance for Bruce. Kanchelskis with the cross. That was super goalkeeping, Mark. First of all, the initial penalty save from Milojevic. And then again, as Bruce came storming towards him for the cross, kept it out again. Wonderful goalkeeping, but United, great chance gone. Yes, so uh, he read it well and... A chance for United goes begging, but they've still got the corner. Pallister goes in. He's so dangerous, Mark, when he makes those runs. We saw him cause the penalty, completely unmarked at the back, that time near post, and again, you see, he's miles above his man and just couldn't direct the header low enough. And I think, Trevor, that is where the danger will come from, and this man could be crucial to it. Star Belgrade tries to get forward. Jugovic. Oh, and such a close chance there for Panchev. Exactly what you were saying, Trevor. This man is dangerous. Now, they left him here, Mark. He's five or six yards on his own at the back of the United box. Now, someone has got to pick him up. First time volley, well, it was a bit continental, wasn't it? But it was only a couple of yards wide, and they must learn their lesson. And Steve Bruce missing a penalty in the second minute. Free kick to Manchester United, which Lee Martin will take. Ball comes back, in goes the shot. And Clayton Blackmore, who has some produced some tremendous goals for Manchester United, that time over the target. Yes, I think he saw that in the back of the net, rather before he'd struck it. But it's a terrific game, isn't it, Mark? We've got end-to-end -end stuff. There's so much space in midfield. Manager Petrovic, uh, who let, joined Espanyol this season, has just been sacked by them. Popovi, the uh, current coach for Yugoslav, but not the happiest of times. As Irwin goes forward, pulls it back to McClare, tries the shot, and Milojevic gathers it at the second attempt. But McClare, good shot there, good work from Irwin too. That's where Brian McClare's at his most dangerous, turning inside the box. He's an excellent turner, super run here uh, from uh, Dennis Irwin. First time, and uh, the keeper needed two goes at it. Oh, that's lovely stuff. Vadinovic showing his worth forward again. Chance for the left foot shot. And not too far wide of Peter Schmeichel's left-hand post. And further proof again there, Mark, that they really are useful on the break this side. Yes, and they shoot well, low and hard. And uh, well. So just five minutes to half-time. Still goalless. And Mihailovic will curl in this free kick. And that's a lovely effort. And it wasn't more than two feet wide, was it, from Darko Panchev? He really is so dangerous at the near post, Mark. Yes, and uh, getting to there quickly and uh, no mean feat against the Manchester United defence. Mihailovic firing that one in, a nice little flick. And uh, just a, about a foot wide of the post. Well, no doubt there that uh, hitting it with the right foot. But here's a break on now for the Yugoslavs. 
as Savacevic runs at the defence and still and that is off the line by Gary Pallister and Savacevic must have beaten four or five United players deep into that box and just couldn't get enough power in it and allow Pallister to knock it off the line. Well, it's no mean feat for Steve Bruce to be beaten in this way. And this man, the, U the uh, Red Star captain, the Yugoslavs have fought back well. No goals as Irwin will bend in this corner. That's towards Bruce, who won it well. Hughes looked for the spectacular, but again with no real conviction. And there could be a break on here. Panchev's gone charging through the middle. And if uh, he's seen, and he is seen now, Darko Panchev and his control let him down. And off the line brilliantly by Blackmore after Panchev had won the header. Tremendous excitement. Savi really he'll be thinking he should have scored, Mark. Well, Savicevic, a superb through ball there to Panchev. You'd, you'd put money on him to score. Schmeichel out well. And then Blackmore coming in there and doing what a good defender. Fairly quiet for the last 20 minutes or so. Irwin looked for the long ball and McClare's dummy didn't come off. Now Paul Ince, that's too high. Well, Manchester United clearly aiming to shoot on sight at the moment and uh, Ince, as you say, a good, good shot really and uh, plenty of room there. Would have expected to a lot better than that. We've had the 45 minutes of normal time. And that's a useful ball too. And another fine save from Schmeichel. And no. again, Panchev found room. And again, his first touch wasn't good enough. And Schmeichel made the save. And again, Savicevic, the provider. And uh, Panchev probably realising that it's not going to be his day. Is Schmeichel covering well there? Savicevic, superb skill. Just a bit too intricate there. <coughs> Radinovic has the overlap though. Panchev's header. And it wasn't more than a foot wide. And yet again, this man is left in space. Could have had a hat-trick now as that cross comes in. And really should have got that one on target. I think he'll be disappointed with that. But Let's hope so. They've given it away here though, Mark. This is Savicevic. Still Savicevic. Shaping for the shot! Well, that wasn't far wide. Super effort. And Savicevic, who showed in the first half, he can take players on and beat them. Gets the better of Steve Bruce. Left foot shot. Schmeichel groping out, but it's just a couple of feet wide. To Ince. Looking for Hughes. Gets through to Hughes too. Shapes for the shot. Will he try it? Looks like he will. And a good save from Milujevic. He did so well to create the space there, Mark, and he just couldn't get the venom in the shot. Ended up bobbling towards the keeper. Lovely close control here, fates to shoot, then onto the right foot, and just not enough power or direction. But once again, R Radinovic can come away with it and get Red Star moving. Mihailovic in route to Panchev, a chance now, Panchev! But he was offside. But well, yet again, Mark, you see two or three quick 15-yard passes and the Manchester United defence absolutely torn in tatters. Yes, and uh, Panchev, I don't know why he was appealing there, because it was a final, the final shot wasn't, wasn't so good. He'd have probably rather have told his coach that it was an offside. Pallister's going forward. Bruce is going forward. Now, can they find the quality cross? It's Dennis Irwin. It was too high for Mark Hughes. Chance for Webb, though. Right foot. Hit the post. McClare, it's in. Brian McClare scores for United. It was on the cards once the ball was floated high into that Red Star box. And United, who missed a golden opportunity to take the lead after two minutes, have done the damage with 20 minutes left. Once again, it was Webb shooting and uh, a fairly simple tap in there from McClare. The ball was too high for Hughes initially. It came down to Webb. He won it, in fact, he did well onto the right foot, the shot looked in, back off the upright, Brian McClare doesn't miss those. So United have a precious lead. The first decent delivery he gets from midfield, he'll really be in business. Now here he is now, running straight at that Red Star defence, he's got Webb outside him, but he didn't need him. 
couple of yards wide. Great effort. Well, you can see there why the United fans like Giggs so much. Beat a man so simply there, confidently, teed himself up for the shot. And what a goal that would have been after just coming on. And really, in the second half, United have gone forward, got plenty of possession, and deserve their one-goal lead at the moment. Here's some room for Ivic, though. Could be room for the shot here. Panchev. And just over the top. It was Jugovic again who likes to hover around the edge of that United box. It was Ivic and Panchev involved. The layoff from Panchev and the shot first time whistling over Peter Schmeichel's crossbar. Good control on the chest. Kanchelskis. Now, can United finish in style? Chance for the cross here. And very nearly a second. Mark Hughes with the snapshot. Miljovic doing well at his near post. And a rare occasion when Hughes gets away from his marker, but he snapped that one so well. Good save. Oh, I would go so far as to name him the man of the match here. Yes, a toss-up between him and Sverjevic as the referee blows the full-time whistle at Old Trafford. A lone goal from Brian McClare in the second half. Enough. United 1, Red Star 0. Join us for the presentation.